Tattoos. The ultimate guide to everything you need to know. Tattoos are a form of body art that can express one's personality, beliefs, culture, or history. They can also be a way of enhancing one's appearance or simply a personal preference. In this video, I will give you an ultimate guide to everything you need to know about tattoos, including their history, art, types, risks, benefits, society, myths, ancient origins, modern trends, worship practices, and religious significance. Before we begin, please make sure to subscribe to our channel Science Deli for more amazing videos on science and technology topics. And if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Now let's get started. History of Tattoos The history of tattoos is very ancient and diverse. Tattoos have been found in various cultures around the world for thousands of years. Some of the earliest evidence of tattoos comes from prehistoric cave paintings in Europe and Asia that depict animals and humans with markings on their skin. These markings may have had symbolic or ritualistic meanings for the people who made them. One of the most famous examples of ancient tattooing is the Egyptian mummies that show colorful designs on their bodies. These tattoos were probably made by applying henna paste or other natural substances on the skin before embalming. The designs may have represented the identity or status of the deceased person. Another example of ancient tattooing is the Maori people of New Zealand, who used a technique called moko to create intricate patterns on their faces and bodies. Moko was a form of body modification that involved carving out designs with a sharp tool called a chisel. The designs were meant to reflect the personality and achievements of the individual. In addition to these examples from ancient times, there are also many other cultures that have practiced tattooing throughout history. For instance, 1. The Chinese used tattoos to mark criminals or slaves as well as to identify members of certain clans or families. 2. The Japanese used tattoos to honor their ancestors or gods as well as to express their artistic skills. 3. The Polynesians used tattoos to decorate their bodies with geometric shapes and symbols that represented their voyages and encounters with other islands. 4. The Native Americans used tattoos to show their affiliation with different tribes or nations as well as to depict animals or plants that had spiritual significance for them. 5. The Vikings used tattoos to indicate their rank or role in society as well as to display their bravery or prowess in battle. As you can see, tattoos have a long and rich history that spans across different continents and civilizations. They have been used for various purposes such as communication, identification, decoration, expression, protection, healing, or worship. Ancient Origins of Tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of art but also a form of history. Tattoos can reveal the ancient origins, roots, or influences of the cultures, civilizations, or peoples that practiced or adopted them. Tattoos can also preserve the ancient traditions, customs, or rituals that were associated or performed with them. Some of the most common ancient origins of tattoos are Egypt. This is the origin of some of the oldest and most colorful tattoos in the world. The ancient Egyptians used tattoos to mark their social status, religious beliefs, or magical powers. They also used tattoos to honor their gods, goddesses, or animals. Some of the most famous Egyptian tattoos are the Eye of Horus, the Ankh, or the Scarab. Greece. This is the origin of some of the most sophisticated and artistic tattoos in the world. The ancient Greeks used tattoos to decorate their bodies, express their identity, or honor their gods. They also used tattoos to mark their social status, political affiliation, or military achievements. Some of the most famous Greek tattoos are the laurel wreath, the olive branch, or the Nike symbol. China. This is the origin of some of the most intricate and symbolic tattoos in the world. The ancient Chinese used tattoos to identify criminals or slaves as well as to indicate their clan or family. They also used tattoos to show their loyalty, devotion, or filial piety to their ancestors or gods. Some of the most common Chinese tattoos are the dragon, the phoenix, or the yin-yang symbol. Polynesia. This is the origin of some of the most colorful and geometric tattoos in the world. The ancient Polynesians used tattoos to decorate their bodies with patterns that represented their voyages and encounters with other islands. They also used tattoos to display their bravery, skill, or status in battle or society. Some of the most distinctive Polynesian tattoos are the tiki mask, the moko design, or the tapa cloth motif. 
These are some of the most common ancient origins of tattoos, but there are also other origins that are based on specific regions, such as Scandinavia, India, or Africa. The origins of tattoos can reveal a lot about the history and culture of different peoples and civilizations. Art of Tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of body art but also a form of art itself. Tattoos can be created using different styles and techniques that vary depending on the artist's preference and skill level. Some of the most common styles of tattoo art are Traditional, old-school tattoo style This style uses bold lines and a limited color palette, usually black ink, on skin-colored paper, called stencil. The artist then transfers the design onto the skin using dots, called dot work, for shading and details, called stippling. This style is inspired by sailors who got tattoos on their arms while traveling across oceans. Neo-traditional tattoo style this style is similar to traditional but uses more subtle gradients, called washes, and additional colors, such as reds, for shading and details. It also uses more realistic proportions, such as 3D effects, for creating depth and dimension. New School Tattoo Style This style uses bright colors, such as neon, and cartoon-like elements, such as outlines, for creating fun and whimsical designs. It also uses exaggerated features, such as big eyes, for creating expressive characters. Black and Gray Tattoo Style This style uses only black ink without any color for creating realistic images, such as portraits. It also uses shading techniques, such as hatching, for creating contrast and texture. Realism Tattoo Style This style uses high-quality photos or drawings as references for creating lifelike images, such as flowers. It also uses fine lines, such as thinning, for creating precision and detail. Japanese Tattoo Style This style uses black ink with red accents for creating striking images, such as dragons. It also uses curved lines, such as meandering, for creating movement and flow. Tribal Tattoo Style This style uses geometric shapes, such as circles, arranged in patterns, called mandalas, for creating abstract images, such as animals. It also uses straight lines, such as straightening, for creating order and harmony. Script, lettering tattoos. This style uses calligraphy fonts or handwriting styles for writing words or phrases that have personal meanings such as quotes. It also uses decorative elements, such as flourishes, for creating elegance and style. These are some of the most popular styles of tattoo art, but there are also many other styles that are influenced by different cultures, genres, or trends. For example, there are watercolor tattoos, dotwork tattoos, geometric tattoos, biomechanical tattoos, and more. The choice of style depends on the preference and taste of the artist and the client. Types of Tattoos Tattoos can be classified into different types based on their purpose, placement, or technique. Some of the most common types of tattoos are Temporary Tattoos These are tattoos that can be easily removed or faded after a short period of time. They are usually made by applying a sticker, a stencil, or a henna paste on the skin. They are often used for fun, fashion, or experimentation. Permanent Tattoos These are tattoos that last for a lifetime. They are usually made by injecting ink into the dermis layer of the skin using a needle. They are often used for expression, identity, or commitment. Cosmetic Tattoos These are tattoos that are used to enhance or modify the appearance of a certain feature of the body. They are usually made by injecting pigment into the skin using a machine. They are often used for medical or aesthetic reasons, such as covering scars, birthmarks, or baldness. Traumatic Tattoos These are tattoos that are caused by accidental or intentional injury to the skin. They are usually made by embedding foreign particles, such as dirt, metal, or glass, into the skin. They are often used for self-harm, punishment, or initiation. These are some of the most common types of tattoos, but there are also other types that are based on specific themes, such as memorial tattoos, religious tattoos, or cultural tattoos. The choice of type depends on the intention and motivation of the person who gets the tattoo. Risks of tattoos Tattoos are generally safe and harmless, but they also come with some risks and complications that should be considered before getting one. Some of the most common risks of tattoos are Infection this is the risk of getting a bacterial or viral infection from the tattooing process or the aftercare. It can cause symptoms such as redness, swelling, pain, pus, or fever. It can be prevented by using sterile equipment, following proper hygiene, and applying antibiotic ointment. Allergic Reaction 
This is the risk of having an adverse reaction to the ink or the pigment used for the tattoo. It can cause symptoms such as itching, rash, blisters, or inflammation. It can be prevented by doing a patch test, choosing hypoallergenic ink, and avoiding exposure to sunlight. Scarring. This is the risk of developing scar tissue or keloids from the tattooing process or the healing. It can cause symptoms such as raised, thickened, or discolored skin. It can be prevented by using gentle pressure, avoiding scratching, and applying moisturizer. MRI complications. This is the risk of having problems with magnetic resonance imaging MRI, scans due to the presence of metal particles in the ink or the pigment. It can cause symptoms such as burning, swelling, or distortion of the image. It can be prevented by informing the technician, choosing non-metallic ink, and avoiding large or dense tattoos. These are some of the most common risks of tattoos, but there are also other risks that are less frequent or more serious, such as bloodborne diseases, nerve damage, or skin cancer. The risks of tattoos can be minimized by choosing a reputable and licensed tattoo artist, following the instructions and advice of the artist, and consulting a doctor if any problems arise. Benefits of Tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of art but also a form of therapy. Tattoos can have many benefits for the physical, mental, and emotional well-being of the person who gets them. Some of the most common benefits of tattoos are Self-expression Tattoos can be a way of expressing one's personality, beliefs, values, or interests. They can also be a way of telling one's story, sharing one's experiences, or conveying one's emotions. Tattoos can help one to feel more confident, authentic, and unique. Self-improvement. Tattoos can be a way of improving one's appearance, enhancing one's features, or correcting one's flaws. They can also be a way of achieving one's goals, overcoming one's challenges, or celebrating one's achievements. Tattoos can help one to feel more attractive, satisfied, and proud. Self-care. Tattoos can be a way of taking care of one's body, maintaining one's health, or healing one's wounds. They can also be a way of coping with one's stress, trauma, or grief. Tattoos can help one to feel more relaxed, resilient, and happy. These are some of the most common benefits of tattoos, but there are also other benefits that are more personal or specific such as bonding with others, honoring someone, or supporting a cause. The benefits of tattoos can be maximized by choosing a meaningful and appropriate design, enjoying the process and the outcome, and appreciating the value and the beauty of the tattoo. Society and Tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of art but also a form of culture. Tattoos can reflect the social norms, values, and attitudes of the society in which they are created and displayed. Tattoos can also influence the social perception, interaction, and acceptance of the person who has them. Some of the most common aspects of society and tattoos are Stigma. This is the negative or prejudiced view of tattoos or the people who have them. It can result from ignorance, fear, or intolerance of the unfamiliar or the different. It can cause discrimination, harassment, or rejection in various settings, such as work, school, or family. Stereotype. This is the generalized or simplified view of tattoos or the people who have them. It can result from media, propaganda, or folklore of the sensational or the sensationalized. It can cause misunderstanding, misrepresentation, or misjudgment in various situations, such as communication, evaluation, or decision. Status. This is the positive or prestigious view of tattoos or the people who have them. It can result from admiration, respect, or recognition of the skillful or the exceptional. It can cause appreciation, attraction, or admiration in various contexts, such as art, fashion, or entertainment. These are some of the most common aspects of society and tattoos, but there are also other aspects that are more complex or dynamic, such as identity, diversity, or change. The aspects of society and tattoos can vary depending on the time, place, or group in which they are observed and experienced. Myths about tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of art but also a form of mystery. Tattoos can generate curiosity, fascination, or speculation among the people who see them or hear about them. Tattoos can also create myths, legends, or rumors that are based on false or incomplete information. Some of the most common myths about tattoos are Tattoos are permanent. This is the myth that tattoos cannot be removed or changed once they are done. The truth is that tattoos can be removed or altered by various methods, such as laser, surgery, or cover-up. However, these methods can be costly, painful, or risky, 
and may not guarantee complete or satisfactory results. Tattoos are painful. This is the myth that tattoos cause unbearable or intolerable pain during or after the process. The truth is that tattoos cause different levels of pain depending on the location, size, style, and technique of the tattoo, as well as the tolerance, expectation, and preparation of the client. The pain can be reduced or managed by using numbing cream, breathing exercises, or distraction methods. Tattoos are unhealthy. This is the myth that tattoos cause harmful or dangerous effects on the body or the mind. The truth is that tattoos can be safe and beneficial if they are done by a professional and licensed tattoo artist, using sterile and quality equipment and materials, and following proper hygiene and aftercare procedures. The effects can be positive or negative depending on the purpose, meaning, and attitude of the client. These are some of the most common myths about tattoos, but there are also other myths that are more absurd or amusing, such as tattoos can make you invisible, tattoos can give you superpowers, or tattoos can predict your future. The myths about tattoos can be debunked or verified by doing research, asking questions, or consulting experts. Religious Significance of Tattoos Tattoos are not only a form of worship but also a form of religion. Tattoos can have a religious significance, meaning, or purpose for the person who has them. Tattoos can also have a religious impact, influence, or consequence for the person who has them. Some of the most common religious significance of tattoos are Protection this is the significance of tattoos that are used to protect the person from harm, evil, or danger. They can also be used to ward off bad luck, curses, or enemies. Some examples of protective tattoos are the Hamsa, the Eye, or the Pentagram. Healing. This is the significance of tattoos that are used to heal the person from illness, injury, or pain. They can also be used to restore health, wellness, or balance. Some examples of healing tattoos are the caduceus, the heart, or the spiral. Blessing. This is the significance of tattoos that are used to bless the person with good fortune, happiness, or success. They can also be used to attract love, wealth, or wisdom. Some examples of blessing tattoos are the four-leaf clover, the horseshoe, or the infinity symbol. Commitment. This is the significance of tattoos that are used to commit the person to a certain belief, value, or practice. They can also be used to show loyalty, dedication, or faithfulness. Some examples of commitment tattoos are the ring, the name, or the cross. These are some of the most common religious significance of tattoos, but there are also other religious significance of tattoos that are based on specific intentions, such as expression, inspiration, or transformation. The religious significance of tattoos can be personal or universal depending on the belief and the perspective of the person who has them. Tattoos are a fascinating and complex phenomenon that can have many aspects, dimensions, and implications. Tattoos can be a form of art, history, culture, fashion, therapy, worship, or religion. Tattoos can also be a form of communication, identification, decoration, expression, protection, healing, blessing, or commitment. Tattoos can have many meanings, purposes, and effects for the person who has them and for the society in which they live. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new and interesting about tattoos. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel Science Deli for more amazing videos on science and technology topics. Thank you for watching and see you next time.